All right, so I'm sitting here with uh, Don John, the Iron Dragon Van Heeren, and uh, just had a bit of an altercation there just before the, just after the way, and I should rather say with uh, Simon Glugla, former opponent of yours, what happened there? You know what, he's, he's trying to come into events and take people's shine. Stay away, you're not boxing anymore. You don't want to take a rematch. I've called you out so many, so many occasions on, on social media. You don't have the balls. Get balls and then take the rematch and then, then get your own shine. Create your, your own shine. Don't come into to, 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 to tournaments and try to take people's shine. That's all I've got to say to him. He doesn't got balls. But obviously, you've got a good opponent coming in now, 3-0, so you've got to take care of business. Um, did, that, um, did, that, did that upset you, though, that he tried to get in involved in the picture? No, was, no, not. It, 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 it upset me trying to take take shine here from people that's you know working our asses off. He just posts a lot of shit on, on, on social media, stuff that's not even boxing related, you know. So get your head straight, walk the straight and narrow road, and then come come create your own shine. Don't try to take people's shine that works day in and day out. We work day in and day out, you know, and I believe my opponent does the same. He works day in and day out to create create his own shine and then get people like this to try and come and take the shine. Stay away, man. Right, so the, the strong message there for Simon. Uh, let's go back to your fight really quickly. Uh, fighting a, a man that's coming from another province, undefeated opponent, a, a new fresh uh, look. Yes, you know, um, I've seen him now. Um, he looks much bigger on pictures and stuff. So, yeah, I can't wait for fight night. Um, no, it's, it's, it's on. It's going to be war. I'm ready mentally, physically. I can't wait. I've, I'm fit. Um, and if I don't knock him out, I'll beat him on points. I'll outbox him. You know, I'll, that's why I, what I always tra I train for this. I train to knock my opponents out. And if I don't get the knockout, I train to outbox them, outsmart them, outthink them. All right, and I have to say congratulations for winning the prospect of the year. You, you're falling again in your brother's footsteps. Congratulations. Thank you so much. You know, that, that really means a lot to me. And that just shows that my hard work, my dedication, it does pay off. You know, my consistency pays off. And I'm super excited. I can't wait. I'm, I'm, there's still big things coming. And I'm just blessed, man. Blessed and, and blessed by the hands of God. You know, he, he, he wakes me up each morning, gives me the ability to train, to do what I have to do just to maintain what I have to maintain. All right, so what happens tomorrow night? I can't wait, you know. It's, uh, yeah, I don't like predictions, but I don't get paid over time. So if I see the opportunity to knock him out, I'm definitely going to knock him out. And, you know, if he doesn't go that way, I'll, I'll definitely outsmart him and outbox him and, and take the fight on points. All right, and you've obviously been performing really well lately. You've been putting it together. What's the secret behind all the success as of late? Hard work. Hard work and dedication, you know. I've, I've dedicated my life to this sport from a young age, from the, from the age my dad took me to, to an amateur gym, from the age of three years old. I've worked, I've worked, and I've built myself up, you know, and just hard work, you know, hard work, consistency, dedication. If you don't work hard, doesn't, it doesn't matter how talented you are, because hard work beats talent. And if you work hard, you can beat, you can beat any talented, talented fighter. And, uh, you know, get through this one. Um, would you entertain the fight against Simon? Is that something that you're looking at? Yes, definitely. I've called him out. You know, I've even said I'll do a catchweight fight. Um, but I can't drop down to, 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 to welterweight. You know, it's too much of a cut. It just shows you that, that once again, he's, he's just a talker. You know, talks and talks and talks and talks. And that's all he can do. He, can't, he can talk and he can't do anything else. So um, I'll definitely, I'll, I'll rematch him and I can guarantee you that I'll knock him out. Right, strong message there, uh, Don John as well. And uh, tomorrow night, uh, you said that you don't like to make predictions, but do you have a message for your opponent? Durant, good luck. Uh, I hope you're fit. I hope you're ready. I hope you're strong. Because I am, and I am coming for you. I am coming to, to, to take the victory home. Right, I'm not going to keep you for too long. I'm going to let you go and eat now and uh, rehydrate. Uh, all the best for tomorrow night. Thank you so much, Aiden. I really appreciate all your time and uh, effort. It really means a lot to us and it helps us a lot, you know, to motivate us to, to, to keep on going. You, you're a legend. Thank you, man.